Alright, water time! Oh, it didn't even wait for me. Anyway, Chapter 3, Maze Woods. Story 2, Defeat the Giant Spearman. That was good, I, need, I really needed to go up and get that glass of water anyway. I'm like, I took that glass of water and I'm like, ooh, wow, I was getting dehydrated. Because <laughs> really, I haven't drank a lot. Oh, I didn't even want to get caught with fire that time, but I guess it's a, not a bad thing since we do have to take down that wall, but no, I was it's like, oh, it's a good thing I got that glass of water. It seems I was getting dehydrated, so... I feel much better now. I feel very rejuvenated. My voice is not cracking, which is an even better part to the deal. And... I don't know, it's just... All in all, more enjoyable. Oh, so now we have false pits, by the way. The easiest way to deal with these is to just watch where the goons are walking and try to jump where they stop. Ta-da! It's like, we need to jump here! Kill you both. Or you can just kill them and watch where the coins fall. Oh shoot, we needed those goons, didn't we? Oh shoot. That's not that good. Let's see if we can make them respawn by leaving and coming back. Ah! No! Go! Back up there! Aha! Yes we can! Makes things much more enjoyable, because now we can go and drop them into the water. Oh, actually, they didn't drop into the water. That's even better, because I thought I would be screwed. Because I think this might be a certain treasure door. Nope, okay, I, I lied, but it's coins, it's gold, so even better. But we do need you, Mr. Goom. We do need you. We need you to be over here, where we can pick you up. Alright, you can be over there, where we can't pick you up. That works too. Okay, there we go. We need you to fall right there, so we can jump on you, and we can get all the gold we need. Haha! -ha. Alright, so let's finish up this, this level quickly, because I think my family's on. Oh! I didn't notice that before. You can actually jump where the trees are, and that will also where the trees aren't will also com um, correspond to the certain gaps in the floor. I guess I don't know if they keep that with later levels because there are later levels where you have to deal with hidden floors. But I right, need to throw one of you up here. Jump and jump, and we get three giant coins, which is nice. 150, I believe. Cool million. So let's go jump on the turtle's back and make him poof out some exhaust. Alright, I think we're good. Just waiting for different water pipes to quiet down because someone seemed to be going to the bathroom or something like that. I don't know. Anyway, let's move on. I want to finish this level up quickly so I don't have to deal with family coming downstairs and being like, oh, what's going on? And we have to edit that out or something like that. Come on, come on, come on. Because I don't like usually, I don't usually record during the day, as most of you know. I like recording during the night, because then I don't have to deal with interruptions. Shoot, 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 shoot. I don't want to redo this part. Especially because I was doing so well. I mean, I hadn't gotten hit by the fire guys once. Looks like he's vibrating while he's... Anyway, he looks like he's vibrating when he's crouched down, or even on the turtle at all. <laughs> I don't know, it's just really funny. Well, it's silly. He's more like it. Oh yes, I forgot about the ground pound, because that actually comes in handy here, because you can turn them away so they won't be looking at you and... Hi. Yeah. Could you wait, like... 15 minutes, or like 5 minutes, so I can finish up recording. Thank you. Just like 5 minutes, okay? Yeah. Anyway, I forgot that you could... Sorry, that was my brother coming down and I heard him as soon as he opened the door. 
and you just want to keep them out of the recording. But no, um, I heard how useful just pounding the ground was to make sure that they were facing the other way so they don't come rushing at you with the flame tongue thing. <laughs> I've completely lost my track of thought now that he, now that my family's come home. So my, my only thought is like, oh, make sure that I keep the purity of the- no, 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 shoot. Make sure I keep the purity of the let's play. He's not even using a flame tongue, he's just using a torch of some sort. Some sort of torch. Too late, things on fire. No, the, I, I didn't even have a joke there. That wasn't even funny. Except he keeps trying to, like, blow through it. It's a blow torch, get it? Oh, shoot. Ah, oh, I could have made that. Shoot. Wario has only the mustache and the derpy eyes, of course, when he's set on fire, because, of course, his mustache is completely invulnerable to fire. I don't know. <laughs> it's just his skin and his clothes that get set aflame. Alright, I think this is the treasure here. That's why I was trying so hard for it. Yes, it is. Okay. Let's go for normal, of course. Get a punch. It's not bad. Fairly easy to spot. Right. Uh, maybe? No, that's Harry. Shoot. Alright, so for the first time we have failed the treasure, but that means we can just go into it again, and of course we've got so many coins that we can just do normal once more. Let's see what we have this time. Problem is, I'm not in. The zone, I guess. I'm not actually. Aha! Found you! I'm not actually looking as hard as I could be. I'm more paying attention to trying to get this wrapped up so that my family can use the downstairs again. Yes, we got the bow and arrow! I guess. My, my mind's more um, concerned with trying to get this all finished up so that I can just leave and let my family use the downstairs again without having to worry about interrupting my recording session or anything like that. No! And honestly, I've been- I have was extremely lucky with this day because they were away for- until 5 p.m. and I just had two and a half hours to record to myself. And it just was such a boom. Alright, so this is the giant goom that we have to, that we were told about, that we have to take care of. And these are the giant guys that I will tell you about, what I was telling you about every so often we will... <laughs> I love that face. Oh, oh. Every so often we will run into more of them, and each time you ki kill them, you can kill them this way, or you can kill them by um, butt stomping on them. Oh wait, you can't kill them that way. Never mind. You can only stomp on them, I guess. And as you stomp on them, they will eventually turn red, and unlike bosses, you can juggle them. And they'll give you a silver coin, which is a nice hundred... coins. Alright! Awesome! So we are done with this level, which means let's just do this one quick. Quick and split. Do the yeah, we'll do it quick and then we'll split. Um, we have either a 7 or a 1. That doesn't help me. Uh, that doesn't help me either. I need something at the top. That doesn't help me. That doesn't help me. That helps me. Okay, so it's a 7. Of course. What else could it be? Anyway, I will see you guys next time on Let's Play Wario Land 2 with Mio Take it easy, guys.